you struggle the rest of your fucking life. I've been up most of my life because I hustle. Yeah. I had a number one magazine, had number one songs, produced number one songs. I've had money damn near all my life. What the fuck can any of y'all tell me? Y'all got to get, y'all got to, I've already accomplished shit. The whole thing the life is, you got to accomplish something. So when you die, because you're going to be dead a lot longer than you alive, somebody's going to remember your stupid ass for something more than twerking or saying big mad or on a fucking thing or on TikTok or doing some other stupid shit. You got to be known for something, you dumb motherfuckers. I feel sorry for most of y'all. I do. I do. I do. A whole culture of fucking. It's funny when people be like, you don't gotta explain. Right. Nah. I gotta explain. It's just like going on a podcast or anything and they asking you questions about shit that happened in your life. They can't pick and choose what you gotta explain. Everybody has their own life and their own character and their own thought process. I didn't deserve what she put on that song. Her go, that's the, like, I've never heard a daughter go at a father. For what? I ain't did shit wrong to Coy. I don't know who the fuck's, I know her mother's in the air, but other than that, I don't know who's in the air. Ask her brothers about me, though. Ask her uncle about me. Uncle's in the wheelchair. Real nigga, been shot and shot in a wheelchair. Flew him all over the world with me. He's a real street nigga. It's my, it's my closest, dearest friend. Her son, her brother, who's, who, 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 who had a different father, bought him a car and everything to make sure he stayed in school and played ball. The fuck out of here, man. I can say so much more, right? But I'm proud of her. But I want her to do her thing, you know what I'm saying? And this is gonna, this is gonna pass as internet shit is. But fuck all y'all who's trying to uh, say that I wasn't a good father. Y'all can suck a dick, a COVID dick. Word, huh? Word. You know nothing about me. You know nothing about her. But automatically, you want to hop on a bandwagon, cause your father ain't there. Because your father bounced on you and they never did shit for you. That's why you mad. You could put all them funny faces in there you want. But deep down, when I when this live go off, you're going to be like, damn, that nigga was right. My father surely wasn't there. Yeah. 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 You can't fool me, you goofy motherfuckers. Straight up. That shade room is fucked up. That's another thing fucking up our culture. Stupid ass shade room. It's fucked up when you're a good father and later on in life, you get put on the internet for not being a good father and people come at you with that shit. I don't got time for that shit. I'm not with it. Shout out to all my real parents out there who taking care of their kids because they need you. Everything's about a kid, but then when a kid's bad, when a kid don't want to go to school, when a kid want to smoke weed, when a kid want to do dumb shit, I guess the parents just supposed to just be like, oh, okay, it's cool. The fuck is the matter with y'all? I can't wait to see what y'all kids going to turn out to be. Real talk. I can't wait. Y'all motherfuckers, kids... Forget about it. It's over. <laughs> Some of y'all's kids, they don't got a chance in hell. They don't got a fucking chance in hell. But y'all goofy asses. Goofy internet asses. Just had to get that off my chest. Much love to everybody. Much love to everybody. Shout out to the real fathers out there. And shout out to the fathers out there who really try to do what they got to do, but the mother got in the way, way of it because y'all broke up. Shout out to y'all. I rep y'all. 
Shout out to all y'all out there who gets a bad rap because because of what the mother did. Shout out to y'all. Real talk. All my real niggas out there, you know what I'm saying, who really tried to take care of the kids, but their mother got in the way of that. Shout out to y'all. Shout out to y'all. Shout out to y'all. A lot of y'all got some evil motherfucking mothers and y'all don't even know it. Or maybe y'all do know it. Some evil motherfucking mothers. Evil. Evil. Don't have a clue. Don't have a clue of what life is about. I ain't never said I wish she was a boy. I would never say no shit like that. Suck my dick. Fuck you and your mother and father for saying that. Fuck you. Now, now niggas are just making up shit. Shit is stupid. You stupid motherfuckers. Run up on me and say some shit like that. You act like a dope, you get treated like one. Motherfuckers better leave me the fuck alone. I knew this shit was gonna happen, yo. I'm so tired of this shit. <laughs> I'm waiting for my pizza right now. I'm going to the gym. I got me a cauliflower, ca uh, cauliflower crust pizza with chicken sausage. Ooh ooh. Ooh ooh. Ooh ooh. Y'all know about the cauliflower crust. Yeah, that's my seed. And I'm proud of her and I love her. But she wrong. And y'all are wrong. And that's life. People are wrong. I'm not gonna hold it. Life goes on. Maybe one day she'll understand how important I was and, and, and what I meant to her again. At one point she did. Maybe she'll understand that. But I know that she should have never, never said that about me in a song for, for all this to happen. This is what I didn't want to happen. But I got to address it. I got to address it. I got to address it. That, that's, that's bullshit. You know what I'm saying? If you're going to put some shit about me in a song, put some shit about your mother too. Say some shit about, you know, the shit that she does too. Huh? We don't want to talk about that though. All right, we won't. We're going to defend our black sisters and our black women. And hopefully our black daughters will see that. This fucking culture is backwards as fuck, man. Backwards as fuck. I don't know where we gonna be 20 years from now or 30. I don't even wanna be here. I'm glad I'm gonna be gone. This shit here. <laughs> what? This shit here, man. Y'all don't even know how... Y'all, in the 80s, y'all y'all don't even know how dope it was. Y'all, it's too bad. Y'all are on this shit. So y'all figure... But in the 80s, it was dope out here. Oh my God, y'all missed it. Sorry, wish you were there. And I feel sorry that y'all had to be born into this fucking crazy shit because I feel responsible for that too. This industry, this music industry, is a cutthroat industry. Cutthroat. 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 The music industry is the streets now. You can believe that. A lot of shit going on in this music industry now. You better, you better be, you better be right. He big mad. Nah, I'm big responsible. I'm a big adult. I'm big discipline. Y'all motherfuckers are lost, and you don't even know it. That's all right, though. You ain't got to take it from me. It's going to be real hard for you in this world. Believe me. Believe me. Y'all niggas is, is, is fucked up. <laughs> I'm sorry. I see it now. I see the whole... We got the lost generation. Not all y'all. A lot of y'all are real fucking dope. But some of y'all don't have a chance in hell to make it. Some of y'all are fucked. You don't even know it. Just by the shit you saying now and you doing now. The future is dim. Bleak. <laughs> Me and my kids been on so many trips. I've done so much for my kids. I was there for my kids. You hear what I did with the fuck I said to you? Every summer, every Christmas, every Thanksgiving, every spring break, they was with me. Me, that's damn near half the year. Half the fucking year. Provided everything. Money, advice, spiritual guidance, everything.
My son is a senior. Her brother is a senior in Jersey right now. Averaging 18 points, captain of the basketball team and graduating. Ask him about me. My other son, Chavo, he's 28. Ask him about me. Shut the fuck up. Shade room. Fuck the shade room. Fuck the shade room. If I'm mad, right? Isn't that a human emotion? I might be a little angry. Don't you get mad? Shut the fuck up. That's all y'all say. He's mad. He's mad. He's mad. He's mad. Okay, what's next? You stating the obvious, dummy.